This was supposed to be a day of leisure and excitement. It's turning into a day of shit and horror. I've already had one accident today. Uh, I wasn't going to tell you guys, but I did actually fall off the bike for the first time. I crashed into a pole. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Journey Across Japan. Never ending cycle of despair. Day, I think it's day. I don't know what day it is. I really need to work that out. Welcome back though, it's good to see you. I'm here with Sharla in Japan yeah. for that high five. And uh, today we're gonna be cycling from Toyama City to Kanazawa, Kanazawa, the beautiful, historic, brilliant city that many people have described as being better than Kyoto. I can't wait. Oh, I can't wait, I've never been. I've wanted to go for so long. I've never been either, yeah. We've both wanted to go for a long time, so this is, this is gonna be fun. Now the great handing over ceremony where I give you the helmet that uh, <laughs> I figured this all guests the have to I wear. Ended up with. And also, um, Joey left you uh, a little gift. Our previous, oh, little gift. Our previous rider <laughs> left you this towel. Aww. And, oh, one piece. and this oh, this little mask. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like a little bit of Joey oh. is joining us on our bike on our trip. <laughs> what are we in for today? So, so every single day, our crew are curating five or six challenges, putting it in Unpan Man, and one of them's coming out. And what have we got? I know what kind of things you guys would send in for us. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Choose three places along today's route and see who can take the best selfies at each from Mr. Terrier7. Three places, three selfies each. Yeah, that's doable. So it's a competition. All right. Got my Nintendo 64 controller. My good luck. <laughs> Symbol of good luck and hope, even though it is falling off. <laughs> it's not a good sign. All right, this is it, to Kanazawa. Let's go. There's loads of dragonflies, they're literally coming out of our face. It's like space invaders trying to avoid <laughs> trying to avoid the dragonflies. Did you just say breakfast? Oh, dragonfly breakfast. That's a disturbing thought to kick off the day with. Right, speedy. How's how's Joey's towel? I fucking hate it, but what's he doing? <laughs> it looks great, super stylish. I've been reading in the comments that you guys really like the GoPro time lapses. So today, I am going to give you the sick GoPro time lapses that you deserve. Full HD, 4K, high definition. Where the fuck are we going? Let's do a time lapse right now. That was a that was one hell of a time lapse. The people are going to love it. Who wants to do another time lapse? Should do another one. One more time lapse. Come on, let's do one more time lapse. Let's do it. Let's do it! Oh my fuck. On a scale of one to six time lapse. That sick was that ass. was so just so, just so sick. sick. Apparently, this is one of the three great Buddha statues in Japan, and I've now been to all three of them, so I can compare them. The Where one, are the other two? Um, Nara and Kamakura. Ah, right. Todaiji actually, Temple. I've, I've seen both of them as well. Actually. Yeah, now he's seen all three. Yeah. So, yeah, which was the best one. I really like the one in Nara because it's impressive, it's giant. It's it, giant, it's, it's inside the building. Right? It's huge, yeah, but I don't know, something about the, the atmosphere of this place is really nice, so. I think this is the sexiest one. I think so too. Look at his, look at his crack look at that lady was right. Yeah. Oh my god, he has a mustache! He's so hot. He's, oh, my god. oh my god. Boring. Well, fuck off. Unoriginal photo. Fuck, fuck off. Ah. <laughs> What's your tactic for today? What's your secret? To do tactic? better than you. To do better than me. <laughs> Impossible. I'm gonna do something. Stop distracting right, me. Fine, I'll Get out of here. Go and find my own idea. I'm not gonna lie, guys, it does look like looks like the entrance to the Temple of Doom or something. Um, it was originally built in 1221, but like most things in Japan, it did did burn down. They rebuilt it in 1933. I don't really know what to do in terms of an original selfie. Should I do something original, something clever? Or should I just try and look good on camera? What's more likely to help me win? That's the, that's the conundrum I face here. Apparently Charlotte's already taken hers while I wasn't looking. Mission complete. You did it? Yeah. That was quick. Yeah, selfie 
pro. What are you gonna do? Do you have an idea? Something ingenious. Yeah? Something incredible. Yeah? Something groundbreaking. Really? <laughs> Buddha Wi-Fi. If that's not fucking awesome, I don't know what is. Gotta get the pose right. I've, I've worked out many years ago that my best angle is this side, so I kind of turn my head that way. Go like that. Get a high angle shot, look, look good. And then... Sweet. Fucking done it. Nailed it. Let's go. been cycling through the fields outside of Takaoka uh, on our way to Kanazawa. You know in Hollywood films when the protagonist looks at the camera and says, there's a storm coming. Well quite literally there is and uh, yeah there's thunder, lightning, rain, death, despair. <laughs> it's gonna be horrible so we've got to really get a move on today. We've got to really power on through because we've got 20 to 30 kilometers left. A hill to conquer, a nasty little hill and yeah we're gonna have to really fucking go for it because I don't want to get caught in a lightning storm. That's one of my worst fears. There's like three recurring nightmares that I have and one of them really? is a lightning storm. Oh shit. The other one is Charlotte's face. <laughs> <laughs> what a great friend I have. Wow. wow. Looks like the <laughs> looks like the eye of Sauron. Our Lord of the Rings. What the hell? What is this? What is that? Is that a military <laughs> helicopter? Just randomly at the base of the tower. On a scale of one to potential awesome selfie, this is it. It feels like we've just walked into a Soviet military <laughs> base or something. Like it's, this place is really it's random strange. and weird. And it was only ranked sixth on the list of things to do in Takalka. Only sixth. This is easily number one. And they've got the Eye of Sauron <laughs> and a military helicopter. If somebody told me I'd be taking selfies in front of a military helicopter this morning, I'll probably believe them because it seems anything's possible on this trip. More importantly, go get my selfie, haven't I? I think I've got this one in the bag, guys. What do you think of this place? It's actually quite cool. <laughs> I feel bad for making fun of it. Because usually when you go up to a tower, it's in the middle of the city or something. I've never had a view of the countryside like this. It's, yes, really... it's not every day somebody puts a 112 meter tower <laughs> in the middle of nowhere. Like literally in the middle of a bunch of rice fields. It's really cool. Come on, Charlotte. You could do it. Uh, <laughs> oh, shit. Uh oh. Is that the chain? Did my chain come off? <laughs> That's the first time the chain's come off. Sean is a bike expert, so she's going to fix my bike for me while I stand here and watch. What have you done? I don't, I don't even know how this happened. You don't know how it happened. We heard the sound <laughs> like, <just> quite <laughs> early. Like but this you sodding. Kept cycling. It couldn't have happened at a worse place. We are um, literally in the middle of nowhere. We're in the middle of nowhere on mountain. the outskirts of Kanazawa City. We're already running Why late. Are we on a mountain. Because uh, Google, Google Maps said go, go through the mountain. It's half an hour quicker. Yeah. What a load of shit that was. <laughs> Looks like this is going to be the latest finish yet. Shit. I could change the gear. Here? Yeah. yeah. What would be the big one? Fuck it yeah, out. No. Yeah, go like that. I mean, we could just push the bike up the hill. This was supposed to be a day of leisure and excitement. It's turning into a day of shit and horror. There better not be any fucking bears up this mountain. Especially given my bike's broken. Oh god. If there are any bears up here, we'll scare them away with the terrifying face <laughs> that we've got. Oh! <laughs> oh. Fuck's sake! It sounds like the spokes. Did you fuck one of the spokes? <laughs> Did I fuck one of the spokes? <laughs> Literally or metaphoric. Come on. I don't know what's going on. It was supposed to be the bike expert from Canada. <laughs> you're not the bike expert, expert from Canada, Canada. you're a, just a, a person from I'm Canada. Cheap. I've got an idea. I've got an idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, it's worked now, look. Nearly. No. I must admit, before coming on this cycle, it would have been a good idea to learn how bikes work. <laughs> Imagine if this just turned into like a, a video of me being chased by a bear, <laughs> captured on GoPro. I've already had one accident today. Uh, I wasn't going to tell you guys, but I did actually fall off the bike for the first time. I crashed into a pole. That was a 
wasn't looking. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. It sounded worse than it was. Oh, yes. I think it's working. I I changed the gear and I, I, it's not making that noise anymore. Listen. Yeah. Okay. I think we're back in business. Bye, Charlotte. <laughs> to be honest, if I was a bear, this is exactly where I would live, um, which is a little bit worrying. The good news is I still have the Nintendo 64 controller. So if I do have a confrontation with a bear, I will turn the Nintendo 64 controller, I will weaponize the Nintendo 64 controller and turn it into a makeshift mace, the world's first Nintendo 64 controller mace. But hopefully we won't have to do that because I suspect the outcome won't be in my favor. All right, on to Kanazawa. <laughs> on a barely, <laughs> a barely operational bike. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've made it to Kanazawa. Yay! Yeah, it's dark, it's, almost, it's, it's pitch black. It's about seven o'clock now, and um, the bike chain's been a bit on and off the last few hours. I'm amazed we made it, to be honest. I'm amazed we made it. It's, it's been a, a, a tough cycle. It's been a day. It's been a, it's been a tough day, not gonna lie. Hey, this looks like a station. Wow. It's nice. Looks amazing. It looks like a palace. It looks like an absolute palace. There's a man waving a lightsaber as well. Lock a bigger. Darth Vader! <laughs> oh no, it's not. Awesome. It's not Darth Vader at all. Got a running man here. Running man camp. He's, he's now stopped running. I felt like there was a sense of urgency and that, that, that urgency has quickly dissipated. Yeah, we finished and we've come to a sushi restaurant to eat a ridiculous amount of sushi and things. Awesome. We've still got one more photo left to do and we figured, guys, that the best place to do it would be over dinner. Given yes, that we're both please. very tired, exhausted, we've climbed <laughs> mountains, bikes have broken, we've outrun a storm, um, we've escaped a bear that wasn't even there. Although Charlotte did hear... I heard something in the bush right when we were talking about bears. I heard something in the bush. It's probably a bear. Probably a Honestly, bear. though. Time to get the selfie. Let's get the selfie the over final it. selfie before we present to you our masterpieces, three each. And uh, I'm going to try and make it look like I'm having fun. I'm going to make <laughs> it look like I'm happy when I'm quite obviously not. <laughs> it's basically what most Instagram models do. That's <laughs> what all Instagram they all, models They all do. hate life, they're all miserable. But then when the camera comes out, it's a smile. Okay guys, this is it, the moment you've all been waiting for. For the five or six viewers still here, still watching this, <laughs> yeah. the chosen few, we're now going to show you our selfies that we took and you are going to rank them or vote for which one you think is best. We're going to name each one of our photos and then in the comments go ahead and write the name of your favourite photo yeah. and then we'll see who the winner is. <laughs> and here's my one. This is the Happy Buddha. Oh, that's quite good. It's an ironic name that's... because my face <laughs> is not so not happy, happy. No. Um, but I thought, you know, there's the two, two different characters there. I thought it's a nice contrast. What have you got? I call this one Yasashi Ikemen, the gentle, sexy man. The gen <laughs> and I call it that because as we were looking at the Buddha statue, this Japanese woman, probably in her 40s or 50s, walked by and she was like, Yasashi Ikemen, <laughs> when she looked at the Buddha's face and it's just forever implanted in my mind. It's so. not, yeah, it's not every day you hear a Japanese woman <laughs> get excited about a Buddha. It, um, it's it nice. was very strange. I like the high dynamic range. Well done. All right, number two. <laughs> this is my uh, plat de resistance. <laughs> This, I call this one, we ride at dawn. Yeah, I really like that. And it's me in front of the helicopter. It looks like the helicopter's about to eat me or something. It does. The way actually. it's kind of looming over my over my shoulder. Yeah. But I, yeah, I'm quite happy with that. It's, it's quite my, cool. It's probably my favourite one. That what should you got? be your new profile picture. Um, I call this, I wanted the helicopter. <laughs> your face. Yeah, <laughs> because the, I got stuck with the fucking love bell. There was a helicopter and a bell, <laughs> and I said to Charlotte that I had the helicopter, so she had to have the bell. Yep, which was very underwhelming and quite lame to take a selfie beside. <laughs> Your <laughs> underwhelming face captures that rather well. Uh, and the last photo, what have you got? Sushi restaurant. Uh, I call this one anticipation. Anticipation yes, of what? of eating the sushi because it was really late. We were so hungry and it was finally time to eat, but we had Cute. to take these damn selfies first. Cucumber sushi. <laughs> How can that be good? It is good. It's Lies. quite good. I call this one 
my life's better than yours <laughs> uh, because I'm clearly really happy because I'm eating sushi that's that's great. There you go. So, which is your favourite photo, guys? Let us know in the comments below. I'm keen to know. Um, but that's it for now. We're off to go to bed. Yeah. After a long my day God. of cycling, I feel obliterated. My head is like broken. That was definitely the toughest day yet. Tomorrow, we're not cycling actually. We're in, so we're in good, Kanazawa good. now and we're going to be exploring the city. Yeah. Which is something I'm looking forward to. I've been waiting really for a long time for this. So we've got that to look forward to. But until then, guys, thanks for joining us on our journey across Japan trip. And uh, we hope to see you right back here tomorrow to do it yeah. all, all over, over again. again. What's this hand weird shit? That's what happens when I'm tired. I do awkward hand movements. <laughs> At what point would somebody think that's an acceptable dish or thing to eat? Stop filming this. I don't want the people to know how greedy I really am. Enough of this!